Right. So, um... Let's see, what should we do with all the stuff that we have? So, um... We have a lot of... St oh yeah, the helping hands are worth a lot. Huh. So we can kind of buy anything right now. Um... Arm buckler is not great. Nope. That's an interesting one. Don't know what that is. <clears throat> Last time gloves, no. Now there isn't really anything that we could use. Well, um, yeah, we... Okay. I think I'm going to make a stash here. So, um... I'm going to leave a bunch of these things here because it's not something that we can use ourselves. So let's do this. Let's get rid of Bunch of these things we don't need. Compound bow. Yeah, I think that's okay. Okay. Oh yeah, okay. The the neck ring does not lose its worth, so that doesn't matter. And we have to drop our recoiler so we can go back here. Oh yeah, okay. Everything is good. So, um, uh, give me some more of that. Wait, don't you? <sighs> Should I drop the... We have a drop our recoiler, we can go here. Once we have the grid gate recoiler, we can go the other way as well. So, uh, I think I'm just going to drop the helping hands here for now. Okay. So. Now, what next? We're probably going to make our way north. Maybe not directly to Gridgate. I think I'm going to go first to... Whoops, can you see the mouse cursor? I guess you can. Um, I'm going to go first over here to go to the Six Day Stilt, go to the Asphalt Mines. Let's do that early on. Well, I think my plan is going here. We're going to go to the Rusted Archway because uh, I think there's a guaranteed cybernetics thing in there. So that's going to be, that's going to be fun. And uh, yeah, then we're going to go here, do this stuff. Then we're going to go back down. <laughs> we're going to go here and, uh, you know, do Grid Gate, Ruins, Golgotha, Bethesda Sousa. So we're going to zigzag a bit. And at some point we should probably also go to Kia Kukia. And before I forget it, I need to do the water ritual. So, let's do that. Yes. Cannabis went down, huh? well. I have no secrets that I can share with you. Why the fudge? Okay, so that's not going to work out for now. So now, no harvest tree for us yet. We're going to get that later, once we go back to Joppa. For that we will need a grid gauge recoiler, but uh, those things are not that hard to come by. I hope we'll find a Dromad Caravan at some point. <clears throat> yes, that would be nice. Oh, geomagnetic disc. I love that thing so much. One of the most satisfying weapons in the game. Okay. So, let's kill these things. Aquamaxis, that gives us a good bit of experience again. 
And uh, yeah, we need some. We have a lot of skills to spend money on. Not money, but uh, AP on. Uh, 14, there we go. Let's not get too gung ho about these. Aha! Dromat Caravan! There we go. Fantastic. Yeah, we are. See? That's just what I needed. So let's get the lead slug. Okay, you have another chain gun. You have a grid gate recoiler. Alright. Good. That's exactly what I wanted. I think I'm going to take it without the chem cell. Um anything else? I'm not going to get these four, and uh, that's kind of it. Yeah. Good. I'm going to get rid of anything. Anything that's stupid. Oh, we have all the scrap. And the chain gun. I should have probably dropped the chain gun as well. Hmm. Ah, it's, it's okay. Alright, good. Now we know where a Dromad Merchant is. That's fantastic. That's exactly what I wanted. Punch our way through the rocks. Go north. Okay, settlement. Okay, I think we didn't actually run across anything special yet, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, that's kind of the, kind of the thing. That's why we couldn't do the harvest tree stuff. to go east anyways. I should maybe do overland travel, but uh, you know, can't hurt to, to, to just go and maybe find some stuff. See, beat a bracelet, there we go. We don't need to. Oh, there's banana trees here. Interesting. Oh shit. It's easy, okay. Okay, okay. Oh no, but there's a salt bag. Ah, oh, fuck! Yeah? That might, that might become a problem. Come here. Salt back, I think. It's, uh, at this stage, it's always a problem, but uh, at this stage, that probably means certain death. So, yeah. Okay, ruins. Aha! Hello, who are you? Love by snap jaws. Also, this cost me some. Uh, this cost me some reputation with. Uh, I should not have killed the boss, actually. It's cost me some reputation with, with tortoises. Disliked by the Seekers of the Sightless Way, disliked by Water Barons. Uh, we're actually getting in good with the Water Barons. <laughs> Need to take a look at that stuff. And again double. It's again the double thing. I don't know. There's something going on here. I'm famished. That's bad. Still hostiles nearby. Were you the hostile? <laughs> you already have a camp nearby. Oh yeah, there it is. Totally missed that. Okay. Let's preserve. Let's whip our meal. 
Plus one to hit for the rest of the day. That's nice. I could have actually... You know, I should probably use... I should use ingredients. I'm, I'm getting lazy again. So I need to be really careful about this run. Um... There's a flaming arm battle axe. Let's see. Trinket in there? Nope. Alright. Okay, there we are in the ruins. The shale is destroyed. Doesn't seem to be anything particularly interesting around here. Yeah, killing that one t turtle boss was kind of a mistake. Oh well. Ah, it's nothing that we... Probably nothing that will break our neck at some point, but... Uh, the good thing about, it, you know, especially now that we have the bounding boots, the good thing about, uh, about the big salt pack things is um, they are pretty slow, so. When you get into trouble with them, you can usually, you can usually get away from them, so yeah. Murder some horses again. All right. It's still 350. It's still worth a good chunk of experience. So, hey, bloodstained neck ring. Uh, okay, the rest does not seem to be all that interesting. Nope. <clears throat> okay, that's a freezing, freezing sword. No, no cell in it. Okay. And another Equimax. Yeah, I think I need to switch to Overland Travel soon. Because, you know, punching your way through the desert canyons gets a bit boring. And boredom is the, the killer of the roguelike. So, let's just do that. Alright. So, now, the prickler gained a level from killing the... Shh, shh. Whoa, I was... That was way too fast. Okay, there's a, there's a chain gun turret there. I was not exactly cautious there. They kill each other, actually. Yeah, I'm getting lazy. I need to be really careful. I'm going to play a bit longer. Yeah. But uh, I need to I need to take care not to not to get myself killed in a particularly stupid way. Nothing really that's really interesting here. Yes, I would like to go down. Because I think like with the cybernetics change, this has become sort of a cybernetics hub. You know, or well, not a hub, but a thing where there's a guaranteed cybernetics thing. Also pricklers are friendly now. What's with the kudzus? They are hostile. Okay. Have to be good this. It could be anything, but it is good this. 
Okay, that's the stairs down. We might just go for that. Oh, the law enforcement security card actually worked on that. Huh. I thought it I thought that one was for blue doors, but it apparently is for green doors. Okay. Yep. Oh no, law enforcement is for every door? Apparently. That is particularly interesting. Red artifact. Oh, a semi-automatic pistol. Okay. On the origins and nature of the dark calculus. What is this? A lot of text. Okay, it's a law book. Interesting. Don't really have the patience to read that right now. Which, again, is a bad sign. survive a few shots if we just can manage to take out one of the uh, we can probably we have to we have to move move in way too far for that grenades. I mean, I do have my... We have a thermal grenade. So what? Let's just try that one. Oops. Yeah, well. That also burns everything in here. All the items that we could want to get. Maybe not the best idea. Maybe not the best idea. Maybe that was stupid. Maybe that was just me being a dumbass. Uh, okay, where do I have the thrown weapon? Where is the is it a trade good? The disc? No. Something is miscellaneous. Yeah, there it is. So we're going to put a cell in it. Let's use that solar cell. Alright. Okay. We have way less things here. We might be able to take it out. Yes! Okay. Alright, great. So, uh, a desert rifle here. What do we have here uh, poison gas grenade. Okay, this might be disappointing. Iron buckler rusted. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Canteen with a bunch of water. Sure. Nah. Yeah. No. Okay. Well. <laughs> Oh yeah, internet connection gone. And now it's back up again. Yeah, the law enforcement security card unlocks every door. Oh, that's pretty good. Don't know what kind of law enforcement that was. But 
I would not want that law enforcement. But, uh... No, that's a different thing. But, um, yeah. Okay. Night vision goggles have... No. No. Are I still both of them? Yes. What do I actually have on my face? A sap mask still, no. Problem is we don't have enough cells for everything. So ah, I like the gym and active disc. Yep. Yep. Now the solar cell is used. And that thing thankfully recharges. Okay. Why does it have to be good this? Oh yeah, dredge roots. Forgot about harvesting those for the tubers. Okay. Uh -huh. What do we have here? Raw bear meat, okay. Battle axe, dagger. You know what? The carbide dagger. We can pick that up. Um, carbide hammer. Oh, a weird artifact. It's a sniper rifle. That's nice. Compass bracelet. Also, that's going to go on our other arm for now. Bandage, yeah. Ah, it's probably not a good idea to lug around that chain gun. Okay, what do we have here? Ushid? Nope. Nothing special, just some history. <clears throat> okay, and there's the sass down. We have been really lucky with the stuff that we found in this run. We have some lucky finds. You know? Did I find the law enforcement card pretty much at the very start of the run? I think so. That was a very early find. Before the, the food system change, um, this was a, a way to get a lot of food. There's a Chari banner. Engraved furs. Let's take a look at that. Yeah, it's just a bit of history again. Well, that's fine. Once I'm done with this one, I might actually do a chopper recoil. And nah, maybe later. No. And then do a grid gate recoil and then do it go north, but nah. That was just me spitballing a bit, but I think I've decided against that again. Because, uh, you know, that again costs a lot of cell juice. And uh, I don't know if I'm ready to spend that stuff. Ooh, fire snouts. Okay. We need to find a lot more of them in, uh, in the assault mines. For now we're kind of fine. Uh, there just seems to be a few of them. I used to be pretty scared of them, but they're actually well, not that tough. Okay. So. Just a tiny pool of brackish water in the corner. Whatever they were doing there. Or whatever, whoever, what, I don't know. Come on. 
What do we have here? Yes. Oh, more cybernetic credits. We have a lot of credits. And yes, there we go. Here we are. Ha. Good. Alright, let's see what we have. Also, what do we have here? Can't have it all. Thought upon mandible. Mm hmm. And a master will come right there. Yeah, we're starting to find some stuff. Jeez. Okay, what is that? Optical bioscanner. This is actually cool. Gain access to the precise hit points, armor, and dodge values of biological creatures. Let's get that. We don't really have much that we can do, but let's upgrade our license first. Yep. I am becoming... Let's do that. Return the license tier seven now. So we can get one more for one credit. So let's install cybernetics and the optical bioscanner into our face. Okay. Might take that out again and um <coughs> once we get maybe get the night vision, but uh you know. Sadly, there weren't a lot of uh, a lot of implants around. It was just that one. But still, it's a cool one because now we know that this has 14 health. We did not hit, so I still had 14 health. How much do kudzus have? Five health. Yeah. And we cannot go further down. So yeah. Yeah. That was a whole bunch of license upgrading. Just go there. Thank you. All right. Um, <laughs> oops. Also, have not spent my points. Yeah, I'm getting sloppy. I need to. I need to be wary of that. Uh, okay. Tinkering. I could get tinkering and disassemble, and um, it will probably. Yeah, that will be enough. So. Yeah, let's get that and disassemble so we can take some things apart. Um, still have not gotten bow and rifle, which is not great, but uh, yeah. So let's take apart these. Let's get rid of all that crap that we have. Phase cannon. Yeah, cannot learn that. Um, Desert Rifle, DC2, yeah, take apart this thing, take apart this thing, we already, yeah, we already have a Desert Rifle equipped, so let's take that apart, take apart, am I going to take apart the chain gun? Yes, I'm going to take apart the chain gun. B4, Scrap Crystal and Pristine Electronics, oh well, at least. Okay, and let's take all of this crap apart. To be careful not to accidentally do the injectors. Yes. Let's see. Everything is rusted. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna hold on to these. Oh yeah, the plastic tree. I'm still carrying around a plastic tree. Jeez, the wheeze. Okay. All right. Good. Now we're not as full anymore. Yes. So. Um. Yeah, let's go north. Let's make our way towards the flower fields and keep going. Just going to keep going for a while. Collect a few books on the way <laughs> because someone was having a having a nice old place here in the middle of nothing. Disassemble. Yep. Disassemble that as well. The tinkering, we're going to get into that a bit later, probably, but, uh... Oh, there's another drum and caravan. Awesome! Where are you? Okay, are you going to kill the slumberling? Yes, you are. Easily. Hello. Okay, let's see. Frivolous lives. 
Pickles for my Knights. That's my autobiography. I'm floating low here. Alright. That's gonna come with me. Because we are going to want to replace that minor settlement with something else. Okay. But we've collected a lot of books and a lot of stuff, so. Should maybe have not. Should not have taken apart the chain gun, but such it goes. So, first of all, copper nuggets. Um, I also do not have the toolbox thing. So actually, if I have the law enforcement security card, I don't need the emergency services security card, don't I? Okay, yeah, these can go. Mm. These can actually go. Fond of my of this, and uh, okay, let's use the books that are worth the least. So this one, this one. This one. So these are the under thirties. So, um, do I have anything else? I have the Norwan Skull. So that's going to go on our face. Shit! Haha! <laughs> right! The portable beehive... ...also... ...is also the floating nearby thing. Well... We're gonna go for the worn Benuth again, for now. Yeah, that worked out fine. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be anywhere else to explore. That's good. Irritable tortoise. Where is that thing? Oh, way over there. Okay. seem to be anything interesting here. Well, let's keep going. There's Equimax around here. Very rare that I see Equimaxes in flower fields, actually. So, let's just take them out, I guess. Okay, there's something here. Aha! Okay. Chain boots! I think I'm going to stick with the bounding boots for now because that's increased. Mutation is unknown, volume 5. Sure. Um, yeah, I'm going to stick with the bounding boots because the increased movement speed is pretty sweet. And the solar cell is full again because we're running around outside. So. Oh, that slacks down that way. Yeah, I'm a fan of solar cells in weapons such as this one. Because we're carrying it around, it gets gets recharged. Oops, I threw the geomagnetic disc at myself. Don't even want to know what that looked like. Cat is now also not happy with me because I killed the puma probably. Um, let's do bear jerky for health and this for that's water, right? No, 
and you don't thirst. Huh. Okay. around here? No. Just a case spider. Okay, let's go north. Probably going to come to desert canyons at some point soon. Yeah. I'm going to go around them. I'm not not really interested in desert canyons right now. So, yeah. let's gather some of that fresh water. We actually kind of have enough fresh water, but uh, yeah. we can fill up some of these skins. Like that, whatever. Ah, yeah, okay. Desert Canyon. Ah, Equimaxis. You know what? Let's just do this. We're going to go back to the flower fields, though. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, and also diminishing returns on the Equimaxes now. Okay, let's see. Chain gun turret and a musket turret. Now we have a sturdy chain gun. Yeah. Um, that we automatically picked up. I think I'm going to take that apart because it's probably not in, a, in its rusted form. It's probably not worth anything. It's always kind of the, the problem, but uh, you know, let's disassemble it. DB4. There we go. And uh, pristine electronics. Yes, indeed. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, folks. I think I'm going to be done here now. And um, yeah, we're going to. I'm going to be streaming again shortly. So uh, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you all again next time and stuff. Bye bye.